Van Ord owns and operates some of the world's most advanced vessels. Our equipment is designed in accordance with the highest quality and safety standards. Cutter suction dredgers are valuable assets in our fleet and play a key role in our dredging and land reclamation projects. One of our cutter suction dredgers is the Artemis. The Artemis is a self-propelling dredger which can reach a speed of almost 12 knots. It has a maximum dredging depth of 31 meters and can accommodate 50 people. How does it work? This type of vessel can dredge sand, clay, silt, gravel and even rock from a sea or riverbed. The Artemis has been specially built for dredging work in harder grounds consisting of rocks and clay. The dredged material can be used for land reclamation, coastal defense or other purposes. The vessel can also remove material to lower the existing ground level, for example in ports and waterways. When the dredger is in the designated area, it positions itself by lowering the main spud pole at the bow of the vessel and places anchors at port and starboard. The anchor booms are connected to the large arm at the front called the ladder. This method also makes it possible to dredge in very shallow locations by placing the anchors on land. With the anchors in position, the ladder lowers to the seabed. At the end of the ladder, a large cutter head is installed which will cut into the seabed and loosen the material. By pulling on one anchor wire and giving slack on the other, the cutter head can be pulled across the width of the dredge cut. At the end of this swinging movement, the dredger is pushed forward by an hydraulic cylinder connected to the main spud pole, after which it can swing in the opposite direction. This process repeats itself until the end of the 9-meter spud carrier is reached. The vessel will then position itself back on the center line of the dredge cut, and the auxiliary spud is lowered. The main spud is lifted, pulled back to the starting position, and dropped on the seabed again. The auxiliary spud can now be lifted, and the vessel is pushed forward so the dredging can resume. Powerful pumps inside the cutter suction dredger transport the dredged material mixed with water through the floating pipeline at the bow of the vessel to a designated area, which can be several kilometers from the dredging location. The vessel can also rainbow the dredged material or deposit it via the side with the barge loading system. At Van Ord, we are continuously improving and adapting our fleet using the latest technology to ensure that we are ready to meet any challenges the future may bring.